Clara, it's okay. Hi everyone. So, um, it's really good to see you all virtually again. My dog is having quite an event today because a neighbor moved in next door and there was another dog in the yard. His name was Loki, really sweet. He was a boxer. Anyway, a new dog is next door and every dog in the neighborhood is freaking out, including the one on the other side of the fence. So it's been a time today. I've seen some crazy dog interactions out there. I'll keep you posted. By the way, this is where my chat setup is now. So if I'm looking here, I'm looking at what you're saying. Hi everyone. <laughs> Oh yes, the new setup. I didn't even address it. Thank you for reminding me, Jamie. Voiceover, who, good to see you. I wanted to set this up like this after I got the Nintendo Switch set up going because it's more console-y, you know? It's more chill vibes. It's a couch. Uh, but I, I hadn't, and then I had to move my PC anyway during the past week. So I was like, when I set it back up again, I'm putting it right over there. It's gonna be chill. Heck yeah. Oh, it's also Canada Day. So happy Canada Day to my fellow Canadian Tenno and to our international friends. I know we have like a bad track record with sparklers here uh, on the Warframe streams, but I, you know, I'm chaotic neutral, I like to think. Maybe you wouldn't know it, but I am. And I like sparklers, so I always, well, I try to always have sparklers in the house just because of like if I'm doing a campfire or something they're a fun addition those and bubbles you never know when you might want some so you can take that hot summer tip for free I recommend it I fear not <laughs> I do have a tiny fire extinguisher just in case straight from the kitchen so let's have a little Canada Day moment with a sparkler <laughs> Please don't let Megan near the sparklers. <laughs> Tang, it's okay. Megan's okay. It's in the past. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, got me red and white on and everything. Ready, Arya? It's gonna be okay. She'll be scared. I'm gonna... Oh, it's okay, Arya. She might run away. We'll see. Come on. Um, is this the most resilient magnesium ever? Look, Arya! It's sparkler! <laughs> Happy Canada Day! And we lost Arya. Oh, she likes it, kinda, right? Yeah, Clara likes it. <laughs> Kylo, Arya's not gonna throw up. It's a fun celebration, like tiny indoor fireworks. <laughs> and the end. I figure if you put them on birthday cakes, like they've gotta be fine to just have inside. Okay, I didn't plan this far ahead. I don't know where to put it, so I'm gonna wait till it cools off. A good and proper start to the day. Mature your Kubro, negative stolen the shade. It smells like magnesium in here, guys. And uh, that's because of sparklers. Will there be more sparklers later? Maybe, I don't know. See how I feel. How the hell are you using a Kabat and Kubro? That's a great question. Uh, well, this is Cora, and she always has a Kabat, Venari with her. And this is my Kubro kitty. I love the synergy of a Kubro with uh, Cora, actually. Using her too to trap your enemies and then letting my dog, Kitty, attack. That's the way, it's the best way. My brother had his wedding and it was a blast. Scarlet Dawn, huge congratulations to your brother. I love weddings, love them for so many reasons. I mean, cake, obviously being number one. Well, okay, cake being tied with celebrations of love in general, I think those are great. Any event where you can just get together with family and enjoy each other's company, which is why I'm also an advocate for dog birthday parties, you know? It's just a good excuse to get people together. <laughs> Do we dare bring up the cake versus pie debate chat? Do we dare? Why not cake and pie? Oh. Oh, those ghosts. I, I really like your attitude, you know? Cake is better than pie for ARG. <laughs> nice. What about a pie inside a cake? Whoa, cryonics. If that exists, send it to me right away. As long as it won't get squished in the mail, I suppose. Cake and ice cream, Pellin, yes. Land on the moon. I really appreciate the pie you baked me. I'm sure it's delish. Is cereal a soup? Oh, a lest. We're gonna bring up all the hot food debates. I mean, is it? You'll have to decide. I have no dog in this fight. I have no Kubro in this fight. Why not? Cereal is technically a soup, says Mysteriously Cat. Okay, it's decided. It's a burrito sandwich. I didn't even know about that debate. I'm gonna take the stance of no on that one. I do not think a burrito is a sandwich, but... Again, I leave that to the to the fine judgment of chat. Hot dog a sandwich? Okay, now that one I might have to say. Oh no, too much, too much. Burrito is a wrap. See, that's my feeling too, Tellerant. That's my sense. 
Kitty has their Canada Day fashion on too. Looking good, Kitty. Oh, guys, are you hearing that on mic? We have another um, dog coming outside this morning and noticing there's a new dog in the yard moment. Can you hear it? I can't see this one. It's too far away, but it sounds like it is very alarming. <laughs> endless, endless amusement here today. <laughs> Jesus, soon TMA ASMR. Had a fun shop. I like the sound of that. Uh, ketchup is pizza without the cheese and dough. Okay. <laughs> Wait, you're right, like there's no end to how we can dissect this. That's why I like to say if I could only eat one food for the rest of my life, another fun mind game, I would eat salad. Because you can make anything a salad, in theory. Let me know if you agree, chat. Can you make anything a salad? I hope so. <laughs> Initializing. Wherever you stand, it's where you stand. Imagine being able to like dress up your noggles like Barbies. <laughs> like how far we will have gotten into customization land if that becomes the new way. I, I wouldn't put it past us, but also it's like, that would be a lot. <laughs> I'd rather create new levels for you guys. I don't know, just me, just me. Who goes in? Did you um, see my tweet, guys? Because I actually did spray paint a glove for it, like Parvo sprayed him himself. <laughs> the glove smells like spray paint. Hey, get away from that console. You're thinking of the future. Ignarius, I'm glad you like the golden glove. I love it, wait, I love it too. What can I say? I'm a Corpus Founder fan. Grakata, hi Yuriko. Catch you in the meeting later. What a relief. You can beat. Oh dear. That can't be good. Let's put on the music. I really wanted a pet sloth growing up. I was determined to figure out how it could be done, but I realized, first of all, Canada's climate, terrible for sloths. It's terrible enough for my chihuahuas. <laughs> and that they eat really specific trees that don't grow here, and that little known fact about sloths, if you upset them, they will just dig into you with their claws and like yank, bite, and not let go. Like they could do damage. Otherwise, they're like cuddly little teddy bears that'll just hug you while you do your chores. But on the off chance, maybe you don't feed it enough really specific leaves. So Who knows? We're only human. I don't I don't want to get attacked by a sloth. It sounds embarrassing. That's a hard one to explain to people. No, if they're upset, they get really fast. Who's gonna believe you? It's called a sloth. No thanks. Oh, hey, a glove. I have one too. Oh, thank you, kitty. Thank you. I'll get this one, guys. Good job, team. Arya, if we were in a fight, would you attack the corpus for me? I feel like you would. I believe in you. Spellbird Umbra Prime. Now that one, that one is too meta. Yeah, that is super eerie. Super intense. Anyone else getting mad Harley Quinn vibes when Korra's running like that? Jack a tag in hand? I always think of her. Now if it were Mirage, that would be all the more. Oh dear, it's time for another sparkler. Because happy Canada Day, that's why. Haha! <laughs> I mean, it's so fun and festive. And I have a Parvo's Granum hand to protect my skin. Today is a big win. Yay, sparkles! Steel Siege understands me. Yeah, the room stopped smelling like magnesium, and I was like, oh, that doesn't sound like the Canada Day spirit, or smell like the Canada Day spirit to me. Okay. Voxularis. Alright, Rusty Finn's classic. <laughs> Becca Rose? I think my mom got me this mug on Etsy? I'm not sure, but I love it too. This is the moment I trained for, you. <laughs> I'm trained for this my whole life? Yeah. Hope that sounded nice on the mic for you. Little morning coffee singing voice. You all know you were singing that part too, come on. Guys, I've been training for this my whole life. We up, up we go. Da, 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 da. That's one of the 10 tune songs too. There's a line, don't need a cipher when I go to spy. And I'm like, that's me. What's signed with Clem B? I feel like Clem is, hang on, I have to really consider this. Yeah, I think his zodiac sign is a cancer. I've decided. Let me know in chat what you think. <laughs> Any other zodiac side experts out there? What wonderfully intense music we have. Bye! Anyone else? Guys, this song, another Tenno Tunes fact, was written in the Austrian language, so that's just sick. I'm a Pisces and I'm under the water. <laughs> Please help. Hey, it's me, 360. I'm Pisces too. Don't worry, you're a fish. You'll be fine. Pisces, what a sign. What a sign. I'm not one to back down from a challenge. This glove is very difficult to get things set up with, I must admit. Okay, um, I'm gonna give our mixer friends a moment to message Bear, who is watching for prizes. Because Mixer, you must do it while we're live. And to do that, you have one sparkler of time. 
Clara, you like sparklers, don't you? Clara's much braver than Arya. <laughs> oh yeah, you're right! I don't have my my Parvos Granum golden hand to protect me from the flames. This is a dangerous situation. Fortunately, we do have a fire extinguisher, so we're good. Here we go. And that's all the time we have, folks. That's it. With that, happy Canada Day. Our, Clara, you want to say bye? Come here, you never say bye. Ugh. This is uh, Helen and Clara signing off. And I hope you have a spectacular rest of your week. Goodbye, friends. <laughs>